and unsurprisingly in this meta, things are pretty much set in stone. So drafts basically read like a throw chart, and um, here we are. As I don't love Zeri Lulu, I am completely over the Lulu in particular, but even Zeri just seemingly can't string together wins. But I do think the composition from the RX, if they play accordingly, it's quite good. You have good one for one you can team fight as well, you have a lot of power there. weren't, and you don't want to uh, get spoiled, uh, hold that thought, vital, and it's going to get aggroed on here by Fate, lands those chains, and he gets quite low, he will have to use his ghost. The finals in the first place, and being up like a team like that as Dogtom goes in. Going to get exhausted here, just a bit of a extended trade, even Ignite will be used on to vital, so they trade a couple of support summoners but still ends up being a nice health trade i suppose duck diamond barrel a bit more sustained with the yumi of course will be very tough fate in particular of course have a ton, has a ton of ability to sustain as most popped okay uh essentially harascos i mean they're getting a decent chunk onto barrel is in trouble but Sivir, obviously especially post first back as long as she has mana very added to clear waves here they go again a barrel Let's have to get healed by Duck Dom as the two junglers this time going head to head. Barrel is about one shot away. As Sylvie's doing a good job. Fiesta gonna get here first onto Krako, who is forced to flash over the wall. Not even get later into the game. Didn't in particular really gonna benefit. Oh, Tinda is getting in there, but did he go a little bit too far? No, he did not! Uh, walking over a ward is Krako. They know he's there. Yeah, Fiesta. Oh, come on! Right around the sideline, he needs to teleport that way. Is so be a little bit caught here. He is going to get. Uh, oh, that's going to sail wide as the flash is used by Sylvie. So nicely done to get out of there. But Sylvie does have to blow his flash. As now he's coming back. He does have the Yumi with him. Peter trying to help him out here. The slow coming in, and they're kind of beating this one into the bias. Sylvie just will not die. The Yumi is just keeping him alive, and Fiesta's play is massive. Is exactly the problem that we're talking about as Fiesta. Yeah, Fate's gonna get it this time as, oh! <laughs> a little bit of a mess up on the shuffle. I hope he feels like the plate itself is worth it because uh, <laughs> he did get revenge killed by Fate here. It's not quite going to extend far enough. That's big though, because now Ghost, yeah. he's gotten zero resources this game, as might have a fight here, Valdez. As Top lane doesn't count. Ooh, Rascal coming over, but didn't go for the TP. Oh, and Fate's got this by ultimate. It's going to CC two of them, but Fiesta gets pretty low. There are so many members trying to get on top of this Azir. They can't quite. As Dunton is in the face of four of them taken down, as Rascal will finally take the Azir out of the fight, but is it worth it? It took so long. As you see Dindin leading the charge here, Vital is going to get pretty low. In goes Rascal once again. The Flash comes in, the Counter Strike on the two, and the ult is not quite enough damage. And they beat DRX back into this one as another knockup comes in, and Fate oh. will just barely live. Can go for the certainty as that's, that's Azir. Very obvious what Rascal was trying to do as this knockaway will get him away from the Counter-Strike as Fiesta kind of just laughs at both of them. And a teleport will be forced here. here both Hyper Carries still just farming head-to-head -head in mid as Ingo Sylvie. Now again, there are three members of DRX here and Sylvie is still going deep with the cat on his back. The ult also going to be thrown into Sylvie. He does almost go down to half health. Very close. Got me there, Velvess. Okay. He did go down below half health, so he's going to use his uh, <laughs> Rift Herald Recall. Uh-oh, my ult's going to come in, but this time the Teleport advantage will be to the side of Gnome Soon. Is it enough, though? Dundon is so fed here as Fate is like, please give me a kill. But no, he's going to go down. He tries to trade it here on a Sylvie, who is forced to take it down. They need a quarter of a screen. They know where he is. position now. Okay. Dindin gonna be in position. Can he stop this though? As Sylvie has to flash away, and Vital is kiting it back so excellently. The Yumi ult keeps the two of them right in front of the Sivir to just keep firing well, the shots into them. A perfect kite back. They knew that Rascal was behind them as well. Well, this, this is four versus five. Yeah. Fiesta wasn't even there. He was getting his benchies. He was okay, shuffling. He is very strong. Full year together. 
is really going to benefit you as... Oh boy. TP's available for Fiesta. So they're trying to collapse onto Dindu. Yeah, I think I'll just leave it at that. <laughs> There's not much else to say. Rascal's just dead. Uh, they, it's a big problem. It means that no Sim are in a fantastic spot now to win this game, as Dundon single-handedly can easily zone these two away. Bait comes over, it's fine. He's got the rest of the team behind him. Now he's got a Yumi on his back, as Bait is in a little bit of trouble. He's going to be pushed back, up and back straight into Fiesta and into Vital. Nice push over the wall by Fate, but might not be enough as the chase still continues. Yumi ults pretty much everybody, and Dinton, he did get below half health, and that's it. He gets a double knockup. Massive play from him. He wants to go home early after this one, channeling a little showmaker himself. Hi, Aaron, how are you, Maybe Maybe uh, on the table for a couple of nerves. <laughs> Wouldn't be a bad thought, but they're, overall, they're not going to back. <laughs> no, they're this. They're going to try and end this. Some sim, they, 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 they know. They, they got this. The assault of battery comes in. They just put him into the ground. Rascal could do nothing this game, and you know, <laughs> he opted into this one as well. They continue to push. The wave is here. Fiesta is low. They don't seem to care. As in goes the Silas. But the cat is on the back trying to get the heals in. Fate will go down. And <laughs> Dinda just doesn't take damage. He is healing as Duck Dom is hitting him. He is doing more damage to Duck Dom than Duck Dom is doing to him just by oh! being hit. And Dinda will put an end to this one. Massive game from Nongshim.